This is an LMC motorhome, integrated, 735G Explorer. It's a van that will cost you 95,500 euros in this condition. Uh, so kickoff price is around 76,500, 20,000 euros of extra length, 752. Um, width is 232, height 296, empty weight 2959, giving well over 500 541 kilos of payload. It's got four sleeping places. Enormous garage. Um, Right, so this has been fully winterized or additionally, additionally winterized. Uh, so, uh, in, all, in any case, even without it, it's got the double floor, which is, as you can see, is, is there. You can use that for storage. Bed is an, an extra. I wouldn't have it. I'd rather have cabinets all the way around. Get what you want. As you can see, it's an automatic gearbox. Quite a lot of money extra for the automatic gearbox, I think. Still, that might be important for you. Black polster, uh, not polster, what's the word in English? Upholstery. And uh, let's have a look at these in here. Deep. That's great. Plenty of space in there. Got the uh, drawers here. First one. First one's actually only access to the gas. See the gas down there. And uh, we know this one as well. See how deep it is. And you've got five of them. Okay, Thetford uh, kitchen unit. Sink. Actually, most LMC vans have the same things inside. The good thing about this, of course, is if you don't need to have three pans on the go, and you have two pans on the go, and you have a little bit of space there for keep the cups or something on your plate or whatever. Separate shower. Separate shower. You might want a separate shower and a toilet, but the toilet's only the other side of the path, so the gangway, so it's not too far away. Here, okay, right, we've got steps up to the bed, and this comes up, and the other one comes up and it's out completely out as well. I'll uh, see if I can push it in a bit. Because I wanted to show you this, I think this is great. I really like this. This is the sort of thing that appeals to me. Great storage solution, in my opinion. On the other side, we've got a tiny space, we've got a light in there, as you can see, fortune to be left on. Turn it off. Now, supposing you want to close yourself in, and you can do that, you can do that even twice. You have got here, this thing slides up open, it's blocked at the moment at the top, and you can close this door here like this. And that goes in there. Having said that, if you do that, the toilet door is going to be open. But you can do it. If you want to sort of run from the shower to the toilet, then you can do that. Useful towel rack on the door.
that's the top for the toilet and you've got their toilet cassette next to the toilet cassette is the, uh, the grill for the, um, uh, the fridge. <laughs> show you one or two other vans while I'm here. This one here is a 75,000 euro van. Queen bed. Semi integrated. So this is my new feature, so to speak. I'm going to show you a few extra vans uh, after after showing you the main one. So this one is a 76,000 euro van. Somewhat similar inside to the first one we saw. Only this one is semi integrated and that was integrated. What do you prefer, semi or fully? Personally, I think fully looks, looks far better. It's more practical, but there's one big problem. If the windscreen goes, yeah, you're looking at a lot of money. You need to replace a Fiat Ducato windscreen then. It's not, it's not too bad, but 100 and, was that 180 euros or something? I can't remember. Oh no, hang on, I spent lost much less than that, but maybe it wasn't a genuine, uh, uh, I, I do that in Poland when I had to. Right, that, that thing here is 75,000. I think this is the most expensive they've got. It's 91,110. Hope that's uh, of interest. It's a nice brand, but it's a brand which is very similar to the Erwin Homer Group brand, Burstner. <laughs>